One of the most important things when investing in the Pokemon TCG singles market is make sure that you're working with a budget that's fair to you. So in today's video, we're gonna talk about the top five undervalued and underappreciated Dragonite cards. Pokemon TCG singles have so many ebbs and flows, it's like you're on a roller coaster. So sticking with fan favorite Pokemons is one of the most important things that you can do when making safe Pokemon card purchase singles. And Dragonite fits right into that slot for me. He was the very first pseudo legendary that we were all introduced to back in the Kanto region because he was just known as like that super powerful, most strong dragon Pokemon was majestic. People still want his cards. So let's dive into today's list. All right, so coming in at number five today is actually gonna be a very old card for Dragonite. We're going with the Dark Dragonite Regular Rare from Team Rocket. This is the second time we saw Dragonite on a Pokemon TCG card. And I actually like going with vintage non-holographic rares. Hollows have a tendency to get scratched, damaged. It's really hard to get them in near mint condition is not the case for the non-holographic rares. And here, the Dragonite, the Dark Dragonite, you can get it for still just under like six or seven dollars right now over on TCG Player. Now, I know what you might be saying, well, how are, you know, how are we gonna expect this card to three, four, five X over the next 10 years if after the first 25 years it hasn't done that? This is more of a safe play. This card is never gonna go down in price, so you're not gonna lose anything. And sometimes it's important to have anchor type cards in your collection that you know that you will be able to sell off at a pretty decent price and not a loss. And Dark Dragonite is one of those that fits in that slot. You'll always be able to unload it and you always make some form of profit on it. Dark Dragonite regular rare at number five. So here at the number four slot, I actually have two cards. I'm going with the Dragonite V-Star cards from the Pokemon Go set. Both the Black Star promo card that comes inside of the Premier Ball and the one that comes out of the packs. The reason why I have both the cards here at this slot is they're almost the exact same price. They both are only $2 right now over on TCG Player. I actually like the, the promo a little bit better because it has the Pokemon Go stamp on it. And when you stamp cards with the set name, I feel like it just adds a little bit more value. And there's actually about half of those right now on uh, online as there are the regulars. There's a ton of the Dragonite V-Stars, about 260, which makes it very, very populated, very high supply, low demand right now for this card. The Black Star promo has just about 100 over on TCG Player. Again, high supply, low demand. Eventually, that will flip. The demand will be higher than the supply for the Dragonite V-Star. And at $2, it is such a low investment. Why not? Okay, so here at number three on the halfway marker for the list, I'm actually piggybacking off of number four, and I'm going with the Dragonite V from Pokemon Go. And there's one reason why this is here, and that's because they are so freaking cheap, guys. So freaking cheap. You get the regular V and the Black Star promo V that has the Pokemon Go stamp on it on TCG Player right now for under a dollar, and you can quite frequently get them for 75 cents or 69 cents right now readily available over, don't do that, that's weird, that is weird. Don't do that, guys. Um, but when it's just so affordable, it is just a zero risk, right? And when you're talking about go, something going up four, five, six times in value, could you see these Dragonite V cards being literally just $5 in the future, $6 in the future? Absolutely. They're not big, huge money makers, but again, when you're looking at percentages of profits, and this is gonna go up six or seven times in value, just in probably like a 10 year span, that's not too bad in itself. When you're doing something that you love and building a collection at the same time, it's a good buy, it's almost no risk, it is so affordable, just dive right in. One of the most popular sets in recent history for the Pokemon TCG is XY Evolutions. And there is a beautiful Dragonite Full Art card inside this set that a lot of people overlook. It is under 10 bucks right now. It has a beautiful golden background, golden border. You can get it easily on TCG Player in near mint condition for eight or nine bucks right now. There was a time where this card was 20 to $25. So many people have been opening Evolutions. It has just kind of flooded the market here. We're at the point where it's just at its floor. It literally cannot get any cheaper than this. 
and I really see it going up in price. People are still loving Evolutions. They're gonna love Evolutions forever. It is gonna be such a nostalgic set. We have a whole generation of people where base set as nostalgic and Evolutions fed off of that. But guess what? 20 years from now, we're gonna have an entire group of people that find Evolutions nostalgic when they give us Evolutions too, maybe. But yeah, guys, Dragonite EX full art from Evolutions right here at number two. Gold medal time on today's list, and of course, I mean, you guys can't be surprised here. I'm going back to the X and Y era, and I'm going with the Dragonite Full Art EX from Furious Fists. Now, this card is absolutely freaking stunning. Dragonite is huge, takes up a lot of the card in all of its glory. There's not that many up on TCG Player right now. Let me check. Here in near mint condition, you're looking at only about 10 of these. And you can get it right now for $22 to $23 in near mint condition. And XY is due for a massive explosion over the next five or six years as it gets farther and farther and farther away. We are still part of a generation that remembers finding XY stuff out at your stores. That's about to be gone over the next few years, guys. So picking up these XY cards is huge. Furious Fists was one of the better sets in the XY era. I'm surprised this Dragonite EX Full Art isn't twice this value already. It's definitely worth picking up, guys. It's huge. It's a beautiful card for a fan favorite Dragonite. Yes. All right, guys, that is it for today's video. Top five undervalued and underappreciated Dragonite cards you should be adding to your collection right now. Here at Next Level TCG, we are posting Pokemon card related content at least five, mostly times, six times per week here on YouTube. So drop that subscribe button if you're into that sort of a thing. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our future uploads. And when we go live, which is every single Friday night and oftentimes on Saturday, make sure you guys go check us out on all of our socials, including Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Facebook even repost daily content as well. And we're always doing all kinds of giveaways. So make sure you follow us there to find out how you can win any of those giveaways, guys. But before I get out of here, I just got to remind you, there's a one particular way that you can go ahead and level up, and that's be kind and be yourself.